All aboard! On a summer day in June... But this time I'd like to welcome everyone aboard the White Pass and Yukon Route Railway. History repeats itself in Skagway, Alaska. Please sit back and relax as we embark on a historic journey today. On the White Pass and Yukon Route train journey, visitors follow the exact same journey thousands of gold stampeders traveled more than a century ago during the 1898 gold rush. Through the town, up 27 miles to Fraser, British Columbia, Canada, all the while winding on the steep tracks. It's a little scary for me. Luckily, tourists don't have to walk this route like the Stampeders. It's, well, I mean, it's amazing. I think, you know, uh, there's none other like it. In fact, some of these train cars are original, ones actually used in 1898. Craig Klein is a train conductor. This really is uh, unbelievable beauty and uh, just the historic, you know, significance for, you know, the gold and, and, and the Klondike uh, stampeders coming through here. And actually even some, you know, the building and the engineering of this railroad and how quickly it was uh, built for that and for more. <laughs> Tens of thousands built the railroad in a harsh climate and the steep mountains. And these days, modern day adventurers are still reaping the benefit of their hard work, including this family from California. It's beautiful. You know what, it's, it's just a really pretty to see the scenery and to see a, a bit of Alaska, be able to go inland outside of the ports, which is really nice. That's what we wanted to see. Uh, amazing, this is actually the part where of what I thought Alaska was going to be all about. You know, look at this kind of scenery. And they are just a tiny fraction of visitors who still choose this route. Each year, nearly half a million people take this tourist attraction, and it's no wonder with the rich history and beautiful scenery like this, how can you miss it? I think that after, you know, maybe riding, you could see some of that and how it, it just, it, it grabs you, it's magnetizing. So, uh, and I think that, you know, it, it, some people think of railroads as maybe maybe not being so exciting, but there's such a history and there is that excitement with that whistle and the, and the, and the bell and, and the sounds that we've heard today. And uh, it's uh, quite uh, magnetizing. The White Pass and Yukon route was once labeled the railroad to hell. But today, clearly, that has changed. Visitors now travel in comfort and would likely say their ride is more on the heavenly side.